This is Celeste Pafford again. I'm back to you with another listing, this time in Corona. The listing price is $395, five bedroom, three bath. Two of the bedrooms are downstairs, which I think is terrific. 2,027 square feet. The address is 2302 Sunrose Street. And the school districts that Ophi here are terrific. Come on, let's take a look. So you've just seen my listing. Now we've done a two minute walk right to this beautiful park here. You're gonna love it. It's just serene, it's it's gorgeous. It's, it's a nice walking trail also for you. If you love exercise, this is the place to be. John, do you mind doing a little panning out to show them how serene this is? Right over here is your walking park and it's great. We also coming up on a little uh, play area for the kids. So if you have kids, this is a fantastic area to bring them. No maintenance for you. You just walk over here. Like I said, it's only a two-minute walk. I have another shot here for you. This is literally a one-minute walk from the house. If you love to do trails and walk, this is the place for you. This is the Cleveland National Forest behind me. The pictures, it just doesn't do you justice. You have to come and see it. Um, you can walk these trails for hours and not hear a peep. It's just quiet and serene out here. Hi, my name is John Lillywhite. I'm a mortgage loan officer at W.J. Bradley. Sometimes it's difficult to do some self-promotion, so that's why I'm here. I call this lady Celeste the best, because she is. She thinks out of the box. She does special things for her clients from a real estate perspective that I've not seen anybody else do. Specifically, for one, this video. These small little nuances are really meaningful for being able to expose not only the houses that she lists, but also to give Celeste an idea that she's a human being. And so that's what I'm hoping to bring out here, is that if you need to list your house or you need to find a house, I want you to reach out to Celeste because she is fantastic. Thank you so much. Thank you.